What's up, people? Welcome back. Well, this is definitely Lubuntu 14.04. This is the lightness of you, or is that the nearness of you? If you want this one to be near you, uh, definitely choose it. If you have an old piece of hardware with less than a gigabyte of RAM, this is very lightweight, fast, and zippy, stable, based off, of, of course, the Ubuntu families of operating systems such as Kubuntu and Ubuntu. This has been always been one of my favorites. If you want something simple, fast, lightweight, just install it and go. Again, if you are running less than a gigabyte of RAM, this could be one of your choices. Now, now this is not quite the default desktop, just a couple modifications. I made a dark, changed the panel to dark, and changed the wallpaper. Basically, right click, desktop preferences, go here, and you have not a lot of wallpaper, but enough to get you started again. This is, the emphasis here is on lightness. All right, the bottom right, power button, time and date volume control if you right click that volume control settings this will give you the also also mixer this is not quite as user friendly as say some of the other type of distributions uh, that that have a default sound mixer i mean you may want to download the pulse what's called the pulse audio volume manager to make this a little bit more manageable all right, you have some other options here, such as two workspaces. The web browser is Firefox. I did test this. Now, I did install the updates as I was downloading this. So this would be all set to go to play, to load up websites, load, load images, and of course, play all of your favorite YouTube videos. If you haven't already, check out the latest uh, Toscast podcast with myself and Infinitely Galactic. You may want to vote as Ubuntu going in the right direction. So no problems there with Firefox. Okay, the start button, accessories. Uh, let's see, let's go to the file manager, PC Pac-Man. Again, if you were coming from Windows XP, self-explanatory. Graphics, nothing special there. Internet, I showed you Firefox, Office, Abbey Word, a very nice lightweight word processor, one of my favorites. Sound and video. I did download VLC, and by the way, if you're wondering how to get the icons onto the desktop, right click at the desktop, and I just added Audacious. There you go. System tools, uh, let's go to the Ubuntu Software Center. That's where I went to download VLC. I basically uh, went to audio and video just to browse, but here you can type in, you know, for example, VLC. I already have this installed. You can add it to the what's called the apps basket and install it from there. System tools once again. Let's go to the task manager. 221 megabytes of RAM. Oh, that's just pigging out, isn't it? Again, very lightweight. Preferences. Yeah, let's go to customize look and feel. I did change the color of the panel to Lubuntu Dark here it's normally the lubuntu not la bull i was gonna say la bull this is a bunch of bull no it's lubuntu default and back to light panel well i could sh show you more but i you know what this is this one's going to be easy download it do the install as you're installing make sure you download make sure you check the two boxes I believe to download all of the updates so when you reboot this should be all set to go again if you have less than then a gigabyte of RAM this is the one for you to definitely check out that's it thank you so much for watching and listening if you haven't already subscribe and please uh, consider a donation to help with maintenance cost of the total OS today channel thank you so much for watching and listening as always I will catch all of you sometime in your Linux future